What's up guys, Random Razor here with another tech video for you guys today, and today I bring you guys a quick in-depth review of the best skins ever skin for the Apple Watch. So of course without further ado, let's slap this on the Apple Watch and give you guys my quick in-depth review. So it's kind of hard to tell, but I do have the skin fully installed onto the Apple Watch here, and it has been a couple days, which should be more than enough time for the skin to cure. In terms of the installation process, it's actually pretty simple. It's just such a small skin, it's a lot more easier to install than a skin for the iPhone. However, the most difficult part really is just having the patience to put it on. For example, to cover the curved edge here, it's not going to stick a minute after you apply it to the Apple Watch. You have to wait a few minutes for the skin to have that sticky feeling as the water evaporates around it so it can stick to the curved edges around the Apple Watch. It also takes time for the skin to cure. For example, if you left any excess water or bubbles underneath the skin, it'll take a couple of days for it to disappear, but as you guys can see, the end result is definitely worth the wait. Since it's such a small skin, it's not really much of an overview to give you guys, but the skin does cover the entire top glass display of the Apple Watch, whether on the Sapphire or the Ion uh, Gorilla Glass on the Sport model, and also covers a bit of the body as well. Again, it's hard to tell in the video, but it probably starts right about there. So it does give you a good amount of, I guess, overall top protection for the Apple Watch. Here's another angle on the screen protector itself. It just almost not really touches, but almost hits the uh, button here and curves right around the dial as well. So here's a closer look at the uh, display of the Apple Watch. And as you guys can see here, the retina display is unaffected. It still looks crisp and clear, and the touch sensitivity isn't affected either. In comparison to other standard screen protectors for the Apple Watch, like glass ones or your standard polycarbonate one, uh, the advantage with this one here is that none of those can protect the curved edge of the Apple Watch. Overall guys, my first impressions on the best skins ever skin for the Apple Watch is pretty positive. It offers basically full top protection around a glass display and bit of the body, and at a much more affordable and cheaper price than other screen protectors on the market. In terms of any cons or things I don't like about the screen protector itself, really there isn't anything bad to say about it other than the fact that the installation does take a bit of patience to put on, but again, you can negate the end results with a really nice, crisp, clear screen protector for your Apple Watch. And if you for some reason want to take it off, it's not too difficult, you just gotta pry the skin off all the sides here. In conclusion guys, if you're looking for a screen protector that not only covers the top but as well as the curved edge glass portion of the Apple Watch, you definitely can't go wrong with the best skins ever. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and that's my quick in-depth review of the best skins ever skin for the Apple Watch. As always, I'd like to thank best skins ever for shooting this out for review. Hit that like button. As always, it helps me out and I'll see you on the next video.